All right, so I just removed my carpet, uh, took these out from here, and I want to show how to get these nails up with doing as little damage to the concrete. So go ahead and, and tap them. And it's not gonna be perfect every time. Basically what I'm doing is tapping it, breaking it, breaking it loose as much as possible. Then you wanna take the hammer on the end and here is the key. You barely put the nail in there, just a small little bite. Then you're gonna tilt it up this way. You see how it's hung here? It's not on the floor. Now what I wanna do, go ahead and, this one's in here really tight actually. So it moved a little bit. Now I'm gonna, I'm gonna squeeze it up a little bit further. Rock it some. And now, this one's definitely gonna break. There we go. All right, so a little bit of wiggling around, it left its hole, so let's do it again. Remember, I gotta tap it, help it break loose a little bit. So the head of that one fell off, which will happen in that case. All right, so tapping it actually helped out quite a bit. There's very minimal spot, let's do it again. All right, so we're gonna tap it some. All right, we're gonna put the hammer in there. Little bitty bite, so right on the end, just like that, just enough to grab it. See, the hammer is, is wedged now. I'm gonna go ahead and press down on the handle. And that basically broke it loose. And I'm gonna squeeze it up on there, rock it a little bit. And I get a little bite. It's actually in there harder than I thought it would be. I thought it broke loose, there we go. There we go, a little bitty spot where it was. Let's do it again. You'll get faster at this. I'm just kind of going slow to show. I'm gonna go in. Get a little bite right there on the tip. See how the hammer is holding itself up? Press it down. So it moves it just a little bit. You see all I got is a hole left. All right, let's, let's keep going. You see what I'm doing? All right, I haven't tapped this one at all. So go ahead and tap this one some. Let's tap that one a little bit too. All right, <coughs> a little bite on there. And the key is pressing it down. All right, this one's in here tight. So I even got an even less bite. It's as small of a bite as I can get. Cause all I wanna do is slightly move it. You see that? Let's do it again. All right, real little bite. As little of a bite as you can get right here. You gotta get just a little bit more, reposition it, and there it goes, it released. Look at that. Barely anything. Here's, here's a brand new fresh one right here. Let's move on. And you'll get better at this. And actually going through and going ahead and tapping them all down, uh, they're not moving into the floor. You're just sending a little bit of a shock wave through it. And then what we're gonna do, just a little bitty bite. Let's see, the hammer sits down almost completely to the floor. If I, if I get a really big bite, the hammer's gonna be up like that. What I want is a little bitty bite. It's probably a little too much, a little bitty. Just like, just like that, that might not be enough. But let's see. I'm merely gonna move it a little bit. I'm gonna reposition the bite. A little concrete in the way right there. There we go, that's about what I need. And easy does it. Oh, there we go. You wanna just move it a little bit. There we go. Let's keep going since we're on a roll.
Uh, these nails have been in here for probably 20 years, if not more. All right, see, I got a little bitty bite. See how the handle of the hammer? Now let's push it down a little bit. And it slipped slightly, but it did come up a little bit. We'll reposition the bite. There we go. Look at that. Nothing but a hole, a little bitty hole. Uh, if you do it wrong, the whole concrete thing around here is going to come up. You're going to have to put something on it. Key is, especially if it's your house, you own it, you want to do this right the first time. Because if you ever have to put carpet in here again, they're going to have trouble doing it. There we go. Look at that. Barely anything. Let's do it again. See, me hammering this actually knocked a little bit of debris out from around it. It's not very much. I mean, it's just a little tiny little piece. And get my bite. This is the key, pressing it down. And if, if it's too much resistance at one time with your hand, because this is a big lever system, you want to reposition so there's as little resistance and that's why you press down so there's very slight movements. You get a big fast movement where you get up here and press it down and it goes too fast, which I already had that one loose. That's where it's going to pull up the concrete. You want a very slight movement. Thanks for watching. Hope this helps.